Do you often feel like your legs and feet just aren't keeping up with the rest of you? Wish there was a magic potion to supercharge them without breaking a sweat? We've all been there. After a long day or even just waking up, our legs and feet feeling heavier than a sack of bricks. It's not just uncomfortable. Poor circulation can be a real health concern, especially as we age. But what if I told you there's a way, or rather 12 ways, to boost that blood flow without resorting to tiring exercises or spending hours at the gym? Keep watching because these proven effective methods could be the game changer you've been searching for. Let's dive right in. Number one, smoking. If you're puffing on those cigarettes, here's a big reason to reconsider. Did you know that smoking is like putting a kink in your garden hose? That's right, that sneaky nicotine doesn't just give you a buzz. It's squeezing your blood vessels tight, making it tough for the good stuff to flow. So for the love of your legs, and well, everything else, let's ditch those smokes. Number two, drink tea. Turns out sipping on some tea isn't just about relaxation or beating that afternoon slump. Dive into the world of teas and embrace the antioxidants that are secret warriors for your circulation. Whether you're team green tea, a black tea enthusiast, or even vibing with the unique oolong, each brew has its own dance move to amp up that blood flow. Number three, pillows. All right, on to a nighttime hack that'll have your legs thanking you by morning. Picture this. You're wrapped up snug in bed and not only are you diving deep into dreamland, but you're also giving your legs a luxurious circulation boost. Simply prop those legs up with a bed wedge or even those fluffy pillows you love to snuggle. The trick? Aim to get those legs slightly higher than your heart. It's a gravity thing. No fancy gadgets needed. Even that comfy old blanket folded up can do the trick. Sweet dreams and even sweeter circulation. That's what I call a win-win. Number four, cayenne pepper. All right, let's spice things up a notch, shall we? Ever thought a dash of spice could get your blood dancing? Well, here's a hot tip for you. Cayenne pepper isn't just a kitchen superstar, it's also a circulatory champion. Yep, a 2018 review of studies turned up the heat by revealing that this zesty delight, especially in its powdered form, is a real game changer for our blood flow. Number five, hydration. All right, time for a refreshing revelation to keep your blood flowing smoothly. Think of water as the VIP fuel for your heart's engine. When you're topped up, your heart's like, thanks, pal, now I can pump like a champ. But if you skimp on the sips, well, it's a tougher gig to get that blood cruising through your vessels to those muscles. The experts over at the American Heart Association have some golden rules. Don't just chug water when you're parched, because by then you're playing catch-up. And remember, how much H2O you need can change depending on your climate and activity level. So keep that water bottle close and cheers to a hydrated, happy heart. Number six, eat a balanced diet. All right, this next tip is a delicious one that your body will thank you for. Let's transform that plate into a powerhouse for blood flow. Ever thought of your meals as a circulatory jam session? Think fatty fish laying down the base, garlic and onions belting out the vocals, and cinnamon dropping those spicy beats. Together, they create a harmonious melody that gives your circulation the boost it craves. So next time you're crafting a meal, why not sprinkle in some of these superstars and dine your way to better blood flow? Number seven, herbs and vitamins. Okay, let's delve into nature's own medicine cabinet with a sprinkle of caution. Imagine a garden brimming with herbs and vitamins, each whispering the secrets of better blood flow. But here's the deal, before diving into this botanical boost, it's essential to have a chat with your healthcare provider. You see, as magical as these supplements might seem, some can throw a curveball when mixed with other medications. Safety first, always. Once you get the all clear, you might just unlock a natural route to revved up circulation. Number eight, massage. Next up, a little treat that's both pampering and beneficial. Who said health can't feel luxurious? Ever craved that deep, soothing touch that melts stress away and gets your blood singing? Enter the realm of professional massage. Not only is it like a mini vacation for your senses, but it's also a highway to enhance circulation. And the cherry on top? You don't always need a spa appointment. Turn on some calming tunes, get comfy, and treat those legs to a gentle self-massage session. It's relaxation and rejuvenation all rolled into one divine experience. Number nine, warm bath. Coming up is a tip that's all about embracing warmth and serenity without breaking a sweat. Who doesn't love a good soak? Let's be real. 
While it might not be the Olympic sprint of blood circulation boosters, a warm bath sure knows how to get the job done. So next time you're thinking about a way to amp up that flow without lacing up those sneakers, just run a cozy bath. Light some candles, play your favorite tunes, and let the water do its magic. It's relaxation and circulation in one delightful dip. Number 10, compression stockings. Up next, let's step into a stylish and therapeutic world that's got your legs' best interests at heart. Think of them as cozy hugs for your legs. Compression stockings aren't just a fashion statement. They're purpose-driven legwear designed to pump up your circulation game. Crafted from a special elastic, these snug-fitting wonders are all about optimizing blood flow, minimizing swell, and easing discomfort. Had surgery recently, dealing with those pesky varicose veins, or maybe your job's got you on your feet all day. These leg-loving lifesavers might just be your ticket to comfort and health. But wait, it's not a one-size-fits-all deal. They come in a buffet of choices. Different materials, many designs, various thicknesses, different heights and tightness levels. Before you dive in, it's smart to have a chat with your healthcare provider. They'll guide you to the perfect pair, tailored to your needs. Number 11, horse chestnut. Ready to gallop into our next tip? It's a unique one that's been rooted in nature's wisdom. No, we're not talking about riding horses here. Dive into the world of natural remedies and you might stumble upon the mighty horse chestnut. This isn't your typical nut. It's got ancient secrets for modern day circulation woes. A 2015 study even stirred the pot by suggesting that it stands toe to toe with compression stockings in boosting leg circulation. Pretty impressive, right? So, if you're in the mood to embrace the power of Mother Nature while giving your legs some love, horse chestnut extract might be worth a try. Always a good idea, though, to have a quick chat with your healthcare provider before galloping down this route. Number 12, saunas. Ready to feel the warmth of our next tip? This one might just light up your relaxation game. Imagine basking in a gentle embrace of warmth as every pore in your body says a relaxed hello to rejuvenation. Saunas aren't just about unwinding after a long day. Science gives them a big thumbs up for cranking up your circulation too, but just a quick steamy heads up. Before you immerse yourself in this heated haven, take a moment to run it by your healthcare provider because it affects everyone differently. Make sure your body's all set for that sauna serenade. Then dive in, enjoy, and let the warmth do wonders for your blood flow. Here's the key takeaway. If you have poor circulation in your legs, you can take specific steps to increase your blood flow. Increasing your movement is one of the most important steps you can take to improve circulation. But if you're unable to exercise, try implementing the methods we discussed in this video. And as always, be sure to team up with your healthcare provider to formulate a plan of action for your specific needs. I'm curious, which one caught your eye? Planning to spice things up with cayenne or cozy into a warm bath tonight? Drop your top pick in the comments below. And if you found this information as invigorating as a good leg massage, hit that like button. Let's keep the conversation flowing just like our circulation. See you in the next video.